there. Happy Sunday, everybody. Happy Sunday. This is Queen Olive Kitchen as usual. Sunday cooking. Sunday cooking, yes. Sunday cooking. Yeah, we don't have a lot of food today, but let's just food today. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's all we have here. So starting from here, we'll call this pigeon peas. Otherwise, we'll call it gungo peas. And this is the green one. I do that today. And it's a green one. It's very easy to cook. It's not hard to cook. And this is brown stew chicken. I usually do my brown stew chicken by putting it in the pot, but I fry it today and then brown stew it down. I season it with powder seasons only. Fry it and then cook it down with the tomato, onion, scallion, and thyme and make a gravy. Love the gravy. This is eggplant. Some of us call it um, garden egg in Jamaica. Eggplant. What I do to this eggplant here, I cut it up, washed it. And I season it with my powder seasoning and put some egg butter over it and fry it. Eggplant. It is delicious. There's many ways to cook our eggplant. I choose to cook mine this way. Over here, right here, we have the tossed salad. I have, you could see the sweet corn, you could see the carrot and the tomato. And also I have lettuce and cucumber there. I made it from scratch, yes. And this is a ham I have. Ladies, divas and Dan, when we have our ham. We wrapped it in a foil paper and put it in our oven and let it cook up like all of these salt and everything. Then we put a glaze over it, a ham glaze over it, and we bake it with our cherry and our pineapple and with the glaze over it. So right here we have all my food right here, ready to eat, ready to eat, ready to eat. Yes, people, food is here. Okay, there are the rest of the chicken here in the pot. And here are the rest of the rice and peas in the pot. You know it's Sunday. And Sunday, you know, we have extra mode come like this. You see that? Look at the cup he's drinking with tea. <coughs> so you think I can afford to support him? No, and support him with my food? No. Because the amount of coffee he's drinking, he's drinking for three people in one. Yes, that's Michael over there. Some yes, people. so I'm here with my food here, and I'm gonna, you know, him, him coming waiting for food to eat. Yes, we can talk him story later. Yes, yeah, story, story, and stories. Yeah, remember our neighbors, remember our neighbors, and see that the children eat because you know, some of the kids they don't want to eat. See that they eat on Sunday if you know they like macaroni and cheese, and you know what they want in lasagna, cook that for them, let they get to eat something. They need to put something in them stomach, good food in them stomach, right? Instead of all this junk. So I choose to do some toss salad over there. This is my ham. This is my eggplant, or you call it garden egg. And this is my brown stew chicken. And this is my gungo peas, a.k.a. Um, pigeon peas. That's what I have here. And we are about to wrap it up by doing some eating because I haven't eaten no breakfast for the day. And Mr. Greedy here, mm -mm. see, look at the cup again. <laughs> Look at the cup. Yeah, one love, peace, love, <laughs> joy, and happiness. Anybody nearby in the in neighborhood, anybody in the neighborhood who doesn't have no food or who doesn't live nowhere, you could come get some food, but I cannot keep you here to live, but I could give you a good plate of food and give you extra care with you, but I cannot take no more body. My house is full. Queen Olive, cook for my heart and cook with love. One love. Bye-bye.